<laughs> hi, it's me, voice. Hi, I'm Richie. Hi, nice to see you. Hello, how's it been? Okay, yeah, I got a job. <laughs> I have been this week, like I, this week and next week, I'm going to be working in the morning. But apart from next week, uh, no, no, next week, no, the next or the next, I'm going to work in the evening, so there will be no streams, you know, as always. As you know, I used to make streams at four o'clock here in Spain. Yeah, it's not going to happen because I will be working. Um, so I have, I have to walk with my voice to be honest, it's quite like crazy. <laughs> so, yeah, that's why I know it's meant. Now, uh, okay, we got 2,100 subscribers. What the fuck? Oh, like, I have not it, it kind of surprises because at the start of this year, I didn't get this far. So, uh, thank you, you're amazing. You 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 did you chef doritos and chicken nuggets all you want okay all you can eat for you okay <laughs> uh this weekend is my birthday uh you know uh, July sixteenth is my birthday July sixteenth is my birthday okay uh, I don't know if I'm going to the stream uh, I want to have time I want to go to the swimming pool with my friends my roommates I want to go to the swimming pool because it's fucking hot it's almost 42 degrees Celsius here. Yeah, I don't know how much it is in Fahrenheit. Sorry, not American. I don't speak American measures. But on the other side, I decided to make video. Okay. And I'm happy to announce that uh, when this trial week time is over, I'm kind of going to actually paste and going to read my model. <laughs> so I can have a proper model, probably. Be nice. On the other side, uh as I said this the size like the salt I have to say that uh, I will try to make at least a video a week at least once a week because I, I, I love you all I don't know about streams this week because I it's so hot that I arrived stretching at home so I don't want to to be dying on the inside but if I feel like I'm going to stream I'm going to stream it's always going to be guerrilla until I I actually have a nice idea of what can I do? What can I do? Not do. Probably going to stream in the mornings in the end. I don't know. Probably it's going to be in the morning. Okay, so. Ouch. 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 Yeah, ouch. What's going on, hey people? Hey, 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 people. Oh, yeah. Emma Snope PS4 QS told me about Vampire Emma's great. And I was. Oh. I was kind of interested into that because, you know. We have the brick for the role play thing of Vampire the Masquerade. So I didn't know exactly what to do. So I chose to do this video. Yeah, I have to do this. So when I realized we are going to do this. <laughs> so, uh, thank you for, for the recommendation of this video. Okay? Okay. So, hey, hey, let's go. Ready? Ready? Dead. Hey, hey, people. Dead. Seth here. Tonight, I'm covering one of my favorite RPGs, a oh. cult classic that brings you back no matter how many times oh, you really? finish it. Do you love? That thing was pink. What the fuck? Do you know if something got tropic? Shopping at Hot Topic. Oh, you yeah. Natural oh, sunlight. Yes. Have you ever wanted to suck off a homeless? If you answer oh. yes to any of those, then I know exactly what? the game for you. Vampire oh, nice. the Masquerade, Bloodlines, released oh. in 2004. You look nice, guys. Troika Games. Bloodlines Troika Games. takes place in modern day LA. But our story oh. begins in the Old Testament. So what, to what? understand the lore, I'll need you all to whip out your Bibles and flip to Genesis. Uh, I haven't gone to, to Sabbath school. I haven't done this. Sorry, I have no Bible. Four. Remember Cain and Abel? In the Bible, nah. the two brothers made offerings to God. Abel yeah. offered the Lord some lamb chops. Cain oh. gave him some wheat a bit. Naturally, <laughs> God liked Abel's offer a lot more. So what? Cain disabled his brother by murdering Ooh. him with a fucking rock. Nice. God was very unhappy with Cain for killing his brother. Nah, God nah. doesn't give a shit. Cain's crime was murdering his brother and then having the audacity to lie to God. Oh, because he Bible, lied. God punishes Cain to wander the earth. In Vampire the Masquerade, God punishes Cain by giving him superpowers. Oh. Nice. 
For crimes against your creator and your fellow man, I sentence you to immortality. I'm also giving no. you super speed and super strength. Super you can also turn invisible. Uh, what, uh, would you like to polymorph as well? Sometimes what I like the to fuck? turn into a burning bush and scare the shit out of Mosey. Anyway, God anyway, turns what? into the first vampire. The only downside? He can't walk in the light and he has to drink the blood of others to survive. God's Oi. true punishment is giving Cain the ability to sire children. But no! Mortality, the only thing left to fear is death itself. <laughs> that fear becomes paranoia, jealousy, hatred. Not for oh. humans, but for your own kind. And that fear ends up consuming you. Just as Cain murdered his brother, oh. he is now forced to watch for all eternity as generations of his own children murder each other. Where do you what come the fuck? into all of this? You're a random schmuck who gets embraced against your will in a seedy LA hotel. <laughs> when you wake up, you're a vampire. But before you oh. get comfortable, the camera boys break in, stake for both of you, and ship you off to vampire court. Turns what out, the fuck? vampires without permission is a big no-no and a violation of a masquerade, which is basically oh. a loose set of rules to keep mortals from finding out about the supernatural and from realizing oh. that Vladimir Tepes was, in fact, a high-level Tsimisi who turned oh. the Romanians into dining chairs because what the fuck? ever found out that's a guaranteed death sentence for every vampire on Earth. The judge oh, that's true. Your verdict, your sire gets decapitated by Magilla Gorilla, the actual muscle man behind Sebastian Lacroix, Camarilla Prince of LA. And you're next on the chopping block. Oh well, at least you oh. got laid. However, Nine yeah. Rodriguez, leader of the LA Anarchs, protests against your immediate execution. Suddenly struck with a flood of emotion and newfound oh. empathy, Lacroix decides to spare you your life. Instead, you he can create your chuck now. That's actually amazing. To get killed somewhere else clueless mm. and alone you're thrown into this game as an unwilling pawn in a world of darkness Ooh. oh man and you're a goddamn malkavian too wow you really are fucked but what? as with any chess game, if you underestimate the pawn, you've already lost. Survive, what? understand, and identify the other pieces on your board. Once you do, you'll have to make a choice between being oh. a player and being a pawn. And I should warn you, a pawn is always sacrificed to protect the king. Before oh. you start, you have to pick your clan. There are seven to choose from. They're generally very interesting and offer unique approaches to the game. Bruja and hey, Gambles are... So the clans are the same in the book for the role play. Uh, it's the same. You have the different clans and each clan gives you something. That's fucking amazing. Oh, they can be gay. Hobos and furries, respectively. Yes, They're very they hot-tempered and have poor impulse control. Tremere <laughs> can do this. Oh. oh. What the fuck? Boom. Died. Oh, They're shit. basically undead blood mages. Tori nice. are the very definition of vampire sluts. Vampire sluts. Every temperature piece of ass does have its advantages, though, and lets you get what you want without conflict. Then true, oh. are like vampire aristocracy. Basically, they're assholes who oh. think they're too good for sucking off the homeless. This is the what? Don't say that to their face, though, or you might find your neck snapped. Nosferatu what? are hideously deformed. Women ignore you or call the police when they see your face. Yeah, oh. Lord! Oh, sweet Jesus! Oh, oh she died! <laughs> Damn, me! Don't be sneaking up on a brother with your crackhead skin disease <laughs> test tube baby looking ass! Damn, these shit my pants. Yeah. You don't sell no soap, so what the hell you want? So, really, no different from being alive. Oh, they look amazing. Malkavians are batshit insane. Their curse makes them unhinged, unstable, and even worse, completely what? lucid and prophetic. They can also spread this insanity to others. As a result, they've got some of the best interactions and dialogue oh. options in the entire game. You must be hungry. What? Which may or may not include... Wait. Talking to stop. Let me. Let me ask. Signs and. Oh, you must be hungry. What? Best what interaction. What does it say? Dialogue options in the entire game. You must be hungry. Listen, Patrick, your friends are on salmon. What? Which may or may not include talking to stop signs and being what? interrogated by your own television. And that the source of the detonation possibly came from you. <laughs> Heard anything? Hey. Kind What's it like there? 
It's no small secret that Clan Malkavian is my favorite. If it's yeah, it looks like playing Bloodlines, I recommend playing any clan which isn't Malkavian or Nosferatu. Oh. Why? Because the Madness Network isn't random. It's foreshadowing. It's knowledge you know but shouldn't. And all these revelations will go over oh. your head when you can't make sense of it. Also, getting spotted out in the open is an instant masquerade violation for Nosferatu's <laughs> which will result in your immediate death. It's oh. better for seasoned players who already know who and where everyone and everything is. Also, I oh. hope you like sewers because you're going to be seeing a lot of sewers as a Nosferatu. Hope you oh. snacks. But why would I play this old ass game a second time, Seth? I got a lot of stuff to do. I got a reading <laughs> to catch up on because yeah, that the game is not that <laughs> isn't very long. Length isn't the point of it. It's the choices you make. And there's a lot of different choices you can take depending on your character, which come back to help or haunt you in the future. It's a very well -conceived I actually like that. World that never breaks your suspension of disbelief. You might mm. be turned off by the vampires, and to tell <laughs> the truth, I was too. So was my mom, and now <laughs> she's no. finished the game. My mom is actually still is a lot in love with the chapters of Twilight in a level that they bought again the whole books and still have the merchant. So yeah. You cannot be on that, Seth. Game more times than me, because this game isn't about vampires, the undead, or the supernatural. Oh. It's about humans, and regardless of whether they're mortal or damned flesh, they all oh. act, think, and feel human. They've got oh. real fears, hopes, and motivations which drive their character. Every like that. single character, no matter how I actually or like that. significant they are to the plot, are written oh. fantastically well. And that's the main praise you hear for this game: the story and the dialogue, which <laughs> has some goddamn amazing. Amazing voice acting. I oh. am the proprietor and salesman of the month several years in a row. The ladies call me, oh God, but you can call me Fat Larry with a F-A-T. Because I know I got a weight problem. I just don't give a fuck. Oh, I love you. Face is not so lifeless. Your nerves not so deadened that you cannot express shock. Oh. Tell me, child, is my appearance that frightening? Yes, you look know, like shit. Of you that is so unnerving. Hey, yeah. Welcome to Sang's Herbal Remedies. I am Sang. How may I assist you? Selling remedies is honest work. I came to America after discharge from Chinese um, uh, Herbal Remedies forces. <laughs> <laughs> parents were sore. Definitely, I am now American citizen. God bless the allegiance flag. Chinese invented gunpowder. Yes, I know guns. Hold on, please. These are good remedies for many problems. No credit card. Uh, kids. Oh, he can't say nothing. No more Yankee, my wanky. The finger need food. Through most what? of the game, you're given tasks to complete by <laughs> Troy. These serve as the main quest line, and you'll need to finish them to progress oh. the story and unlock new locations. You'll get to meet the other major powers in LA as well. There's the oh. Camarilla, which uphold the status quo and enforce the masquerade religiously. Anarchs oh. who respect the masquerade, but hate the politics and hierarchy of a Camarilla. The Sabbat, who don't give a shit about the masquerade and seek oh. dominion over mankind. And so finally, they have there's the Kuei Jin, Asian. Kuei Jin. Vampires that have recently moved into Chinatown and filled it with gacha machines. They oh, use a <laughs> negative chi formed by gambling, organized crime, and gacha balls to fuel what? their aggressive business practices. Besides the main story, there's dozens of side missions to complete. None of these are your standard fetch quests either. They force you to oh. think and decide for yourself how to best approach them. Completing mm. missions is important I love this. since that's your only I really way love it, yeah. Is this is like the game the game upgrading your character. Most of them you have the same result. Stop. Peacefully by talking or stalking. Some of them, however, <laughs> cannot. And whether it's Why? Over vampires or the same dude in a wife beater, copy pasted 200 <laughs> times, violence yeah. is inevitable. So building your character to be a smooth talking, anemic slug might not oh. be the best idea. There's a lot of nightclubs in this game, by the way. They're a good place to feed. They've also got some pretty good music. Mm -hmm. You can also dance. Even outside, there's some very nice ambience to fit the mood. It makes you feel mm. like you're actually there. This game game taught me that Santa Monica is a shithole, no. so don't feel bad about the people you kill there. In a way, you're saving them from the pain of living in Santa Monica. <laughs> Bloodlines controls quite simply. Ah, oh, shit, this is a higher. While interacting with objects and NPCs, and you pan out to third person whenever you're in combat. combat what? can be enjoyable, but mostly... 
it is not enjoyable. Combat what? boils down to mashing left click while desperately scrolling oh. with your mouse wheel and smashing right click to reactivate blood buff. Oh, oh yeah, every clan's got vampire superpowers or disciplines unique to their bloodline. Many of you right. cost a lot of blood to use, but they're visually impressive. They can end fights instantly and they break the monotony of endless button mashing while hoping Th and that's actually that something I really like, to be honest. It's not going to hunt, but at least. Instead. But unless you've invested skill points into firearms, you might be dead by the time you take a shot. Outside oh. of combat, you'll be doing everything from investigating serial murders to evicting unfriendly spirits out of hotels. The Ocean House Hotel is there to remind you that just because you're a spooky bloodsucker doesn't mean you're not capable of terror. The Ocean oh. House is so infamous that it's got its own console command to skip the entire sequence. It's probably what? one of the best horror segments I've ever seen in the game, and they managed to do it without a single jump scare. Just a feeling of pure condensed dread. Your inventory is Ooh. conveniently infinite, so you never That's have to good. worry about space. I love that. Pick up useful items like blood bags and firepower, and Ooh. less useful items like birth control and estrogen pills. This what? game is difficult, and there's a few frustrating points in the story that might make you, you suffer quit. from them. Point what? number one, Hollywood sewers. At some point in the story, you have to find the Nosferatu, as they've gone into hiding for reasons unknown. And then you know, why? Nothing to do with a free billion Samisi flesh puppets clogging up every what? sewer drain. And you're hey. gonna have to fight them all, including this big bitch who throws spare ribs at you. Also, why no throwing ribs? In the sewers. So, I hope you brought an entire fridge supply <laughs> of blood with you. Good luck. Luckily, the unofficial patch fixes this completely. The good why? old copy comes with a patch pre-installed. So you can oh. take a convenient shortcut and save yourself the pain of going through this program. Oh, hell. okay. Trick. Werewolf Park. In this universe, werewolves are incredibly rare. But they're also oh. invincible killing machines. In fact, oh. you can't fight this puppy at all. It's immune to damage and can stun lock you to death in several swipes. This all happens in a span of five seconds, so most players oh. never even get the chance to understand what the fuck is going on before they make Why their do you final laugh? death. Again, again, and again. Even though it kills you in five seconds, you're expected to survive for about five minutes. Oh, and forget about regenerating your health. Werewolf claws burn through your flesh, so it can't be healed back. However, hey. after years of dying yeah, to that same werewolf, I found out you can actually kill it. What the hell? How is that supposed Why? to know that you're actually meant to run into the observatory, flick the circuit breaker outside, run back in, open the dome, lure it into the dome, what? and crush it to death? How the hell was I supposed to know that? The answer is, How? I didn't. I had to look you it didn't. up on the wiki. Oh. After years of suffering through the same <laughs> the wiki exists. Through, this is oddly satisfying. However, if you Run. can endure past those rough patches in the story, you'll start piecing together what's going on. The concern oh. and focus of every major faction in LA is in one way or another centered on the arrival of a certain archaeological treasure, the Ankaran sarcophagus, which throughout the game has a bad habit of getting stolen. What's inside? Oh, Who what's knows? Inside? An old Assyrian king or a slumbering antediluvian, one of the oldest granddaddy vampires oh. out there. Who, if you traced your blood far back enough, might be one of your original fathers. Half the city oh. believes the latter. They also believe that the moment father dearest wakes up from his slumber, he's gonna be hungry. Real Real hungry. hungry. And he'll sate that hunger by feasting on his children. Where oh, goes, that's why of Cain, which makes our fate. Your fate and the fate of the Ankaran sarcophagus are inescapably intertwined. Will you open up the sarcophagus or seal it away for all Ooh, eternity? Oh, that's that a good dilemma. Is up to you. Vampire love it. Grade Bloodlines, a very unique, flawed, and fantastic diamond <laughs> of a game. Terrible combat, zero out of ten. As always, oh. more content to come, so stay tuned. Now I'm just fucking Pretty with combat, it. Ten but out it's of ten. Sorry, one of my okay. and one of the most replayable RPGs of all time. There's very few games out there that keep pulling you back over and oh. over again and still manage to make each playthrough different and this is one of them go buy it go play it oh i will i will get into the atmosphere get a craving on day for it and i'm going to recommend this for the rest of your to be honest i'm going to recommend this to my roommates because one of them has the book and i'm just going to be like hey if you want to prepare one pie the most great why don't you play this game by it in your Steam so you can share it, you know, so you can play it for free.
And and you can know that other things that have been inspiration, you know, for a small campaign of Vampire the Masquerade. I don't know, maybe. <laughs> your natural life because there's nothing quite like it a warm thanks to the many members of a merchant's oh. guild generously funding and bankrolling the yeah. videos you're all truly wonderful like you all a visitor at your door next week don't open door don't open it's door a witness they saw it's so annoying <laughs> i could use a halloween looking s and m gremlin like yourself to help <laughs> haunt some people out of some loot for me what now, let's see what we got on good old camera three. Oh well hello there <laughs> i've been thinking about you oh yeah i want to lick you oh. all over what and make my way down to your creamy center and what the De get your hands off my bavarian cream He's <laughs> going to go to a fancy restaurant. You going to order snails? What? Don't eat them. That's disgusting. <laughs> Snail very <laughs> What? Uh, Phil's here. Got to run. Great breakfast, honey. Have a good day, dear. I'm glad you liked the muffins. Hey, what's that on the counter? That's not my margarine. That's butter. It What? That bitch. You know I'm supposed to watch my LDL levels. I, I thought it would be a nice change. You couldn't even tell. What you the fuck? A divorce? You're trying to kill me. I'm glad I slept with your sister. What the fuck? I thought it was margarine grade B butter. Other well, rancid taste of margarine with all the saturated fat of butter. Uh, what? Love will find you next week. Is what is that? Not too long. Husband find you too. Does your what? penis always seem to be getting in the way? I got yeah. the last of the groceries, honey. I just need to close the trunk. <laughs> One more nail and this birdhouse will be as good as new. He was thinking, no! Oh! I'm sorry, sir. This dressing room is for women only. You don't have to let this happen to you. Hi, I'm Dr. Fred Tuck. What? Don't let your penis interfere with the quality of your life anymore. I have performed over 300 sex changes in my career, and not one of my patients has ever asked for their tackle box back. Why? Dr. Tuck's sex exchange in the next month, and I'll give you a free estimate. Don't let your peace interfere with your peace of it's... mind. Tuck Sex Exchange, located off Beverly Drive. Why? Next time you get on plane, change seat to exit row. Please make sure you not sit next to big fat ass. Camera 79, oh. nothing. Camera 80, nothing. Camera 81. Hey, 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 it's me. Hey there, Chunk. Doing a fine job. Keep up the good work, me. Last He's year, happy. Year, candidate Michael Redmond spot sports utility vehicle. Three months later, oh. there were two separate incidences of hit and runs by an unidentified SUV in his area. Is Democratic candidate Michael Redmond to blame? What? Can you afford to take that chance? Can your children? Vote Republican Senator Robert Thorne, a candidate that has never what committed a particular homicide. Democratic candidate <laughs> Michael Redmond has never <laughs> his opinion on child pornography. Is it because he's hiding something? What the Which fuck? A child pornographer voting on this nation's laws. Who do you trust your children's future? Is this like politics? Co what? Republican Senator Robert Thorne, the candidate that is committed to locking up child pornographers. Democratic candidate Michael Rebens recently sued Senator Robert Thorne for accusing Rebens of being a murderous child pornographer. A what? He had previously said he was against clogging up courts with frivolous lawsuits. Wouldn't this make him a hypocrite? Would oh. You hypocrites your next congressman? Would you want your children to become hypocrites? Vote Republican Senator Robert Thorne, a candidate not accused of being a murderous child pornographer. What the Sorry, fuck? This is the only channel you get. <laughs> Good night and have a pleasant evening. You too. What the fuck is that? <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Just gonna say. The lines are getting me. I actually want to play the game just yes, because of those lines and what they have to die that. Actually, really good. <laughs> what is this? This is like God hunt. I'm going to play something because just this video is selling me so well, this game. <laughs> okay, so thank you for watching this video, okay? Uh, see you next video, okay? I will not stream for that, but, 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 I still love you. Thank you so much. This week, uh, this weekend is my my birthday. This life is still, so you can send me regards and you can send me happy birthday and things like that. Okay, I'm going to post in the community when the time comes. Okay, so you can send me yeah, no, congratulations or things like that. And many 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 thanks to you all. Okay, okay, bye, adiósito, adiós.